啦哒哒哒哒，啦哒哒哒哒，啦哒哒哒哒。Hi, I'm an artist and illustrator currently living in Burlington, Vermont, and I have a greeting card line called J. Halloween's Art Cards. I never thought I would have a greeting card line. I never thought I would be an artist, but I am. I'm an artist with a greeting card line, and I love it. It's what gets me up in the morning. I've always loved art. My older sister helped me write a book when I was, I don't know, maybe seven or eight. We are sitting at my studio in Burlington, Vermont. This is the first time in my life I've ever had a studio. Prior to this, I was working on my kitchen table at every previous apartment I ever had, and I would pretty much just work at night from midnight on because that's when my roommates were done with the kitchen. Now I have a place where I can keep everything. But a studio space is also, I think, in some sense, a meditative environment. After I graduated uh, college, I spent a year teaching English in the south of France. While I was living in the south of France, I had a conversation with my grandma on the phone. And my grandma kept asking me about grad school. When are you going to grad school? And at the time, I'd been doing a lot of sketching. I'd been taking an art class there. And, and I remember I asked her, Grandma, do you think it would be okay? Would it be okay with you if I, if I went to art school? Because I've been thinking about that. And she said, you know, you've always been good at art. I think it'll be okay. And so I decided to go to design school not long after that. I went to Parsons School of Design in New York City. I got an associate degree in fashion design. I loved Parsons. I loved being in design school, being in New York, being able to draw and do artwork every day. It was like a dream come true, even though I hadn't realized it was a dream. <laughs> and then being in the fashion industry, there was so much going on, and it was also beautiful. <laughs> it was pretty unique. Since I've moved to Vermont, I have gotten experience um, in a variety of different art forms. I've started teaching a fashion drawing class, and I've also done the farmer's markets. So um, in showing my art at the farmer's markets, that's where the idea for the greeting cards came out of. Right now, I have 18 styles of greeting cards. I started with just six styles, and now we have 18. I also found a local supplier in Vermont to print the cards and they're packaged in eco-friendly plastic. I have three retail stores in Vermont that are selling the cards. They actually sold out um, within several weeks of the first shipment in two of these stores. I love the dinosaur with the T-Rex one, actually. I really like the stick, the kind of line drawings, um, and dinosaurs are actually a team symbol for an ultimate Frisbee team. The T-Rex is a logo of ours, and you know, kind of looks really awesome. <laughs> The one that speaks to me most because I'm a professional dancer is the girl with the big hair, the iPod chick, um, just because she's so inspiring to me and I've been giving them as gifts to like a lot of my dancer friends. So. The customers love the unique style of them and the unique twist. It's not a card that you kind of put away in a drawer, it's a card that you want to hang up on a wall or you display for friends or family to see. All the customers really loved them and they sold out almost immediately. For me, it's nice to know that the work has a destination. It's nice to know that someone's going to see it, and they're going to enjoy it, and then that it has a use, that it's going to help them communicate with someone. The cards have gone in a slightly different direction lately. I've been exploring fonts and words and typefaces. I love typefaces. We have everything from 
happy birthday, to thanks, um, to hello. And then there's also a new card that just says happy on it that I'm really excited about because it's really versatile uh, and it's fun. You can use it to say happy anniversary or you know happy first day on your new job. Um, or you can just send someone a happy. <laughs> hey, I wanted to send you a happy. <laughs> My long-term goal is to have nationwide distribution for J. Heloise art cards, but in the meantime, I'm hoping to sell 200 cards in 200 days. In order to do that, I'm going to need support in several major areas. Creation of a great new interactive website that's easy to use, um, doing high volume orders so that I can bring the cost of the cards down, and a big sales effort so that the cards are in stores by the holidays. And I should mention there are some fantastic Kickstarter exclusive thank you gifts.